Market started off on the upside today after yesterday's route and, of course, uh, unable to really hold on to that today. Uh, market did kind of rally, wound up giving those gains up primarily by the end of the day. The really big news, though, was in oil prices. Oil fell over $4 a, a barrel today, uh, well below $55 a barrel. And the issue there is, is that we've now broken that uptrend from the previous lows. And historically, we've got a, a graphic coming out on this on Thursday in our article about oil and its relation to the economy, inflation, interest rates. Oil is very intensive in terms of manufacturing, capital expenditures, labor, etc. So when you have big declines in oil, it tends to show up in both weaker economic activity, particularly on the manufacturing side of the equation, and lower rates of inflation. That may very well put the Federal Reserve in a bit of a box here in terms of continuing to hike interest rates. The important thing here is that the markets continue to trade below that 200-day moving average. It is critical. That by Friday, we close back above this 200-day moving average. If we don't, the lows from earlier this uh, in October are going to be critical that the market holds on to. A break of those lows, we're potentially going to be retesting the lows back from February of this year. There is tremendously more downside risk currently in the markets than there is upside reward. So being defensive is much more important here. We're taking a look at some of these technology stocks, like the Fane stocks in particular, Google is about to have the 50-day cross below the 200-day. Amazon is also heading down lower, breaking its 200-day moving average. Apple also broke its 200-day moving average day. That list goes on and on. In fact, today we actually sold more of our technology stocks into the rally earlier this morning, raising more cash in portfolios and becoming more defensive. There is more than enough evidence here that the bull market trend has changed, at least for now, and you need to be more cautious than not.